Somebody said to me the other day, you're the most famous person in the world by far. I said, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. They said, yes, you are. I said, no. They said, who's more famous? I said, Jesus Christ. This is so emblematic of everything wrong with Trump. He doesn't think he's more famous than Jesus. He thinks he is Jesus. Although I wonder if he knows how that story ends. And he loathes these people who worship him. We won the evangelicals. Authority to declare the White House as holy ground. We won with poorly educated. I love the poorly educated. Now think about that. Trump's always been this close, not to something decent and honorable, but to a devastating collapse. Well, something like that. Here's what's gonna happen. He will lose everything. His brand is dead. Fortune 1000 companies are running away from Donnie like he's Flint, Michigan tap water. And his supporters, you think this deliverance crowd plays golf at Mar-a-Lago? Then there's a laundry list of federal charges that include everything from tax fraud to money laundering to treason. He's gonna wish his biggest problem was a Russian hooker who can write her name in the snow. Then there's state charges in New York, and New York hates Trump. These prosecutors have been waiting for January 20th like they're 10 year olds at a birthday party and the balloon clown just showed up. His friends are gone, his family will turn, and he will be alone, but for the occasional Ted Cruz ass sniff. Donald is a bully. Donald Trump will be overwhelmingly reelected. I know, I know. What if he runs for president again? That's a nightmare. Yeah, but not for us, for them. Goddamn right. Who's with me? Gaye, mother. You're in a lot of trouble, Donnie. Screw you. Woo! Winning. Yes! <laughs>